Hey everybody, DSJ here. Welcome back to Heavy Rain. And it's time for more Ethan. This is going to be fun. Let's go with a bat. A bat. A wolf. A wolf's head. A crab. Hmm. A shadow. A threatening shadow. Not that I think about it. it looks like death, but oh well. Been seeing the strength, folks. I have the results of your MRI scans. Everything seems to be normal. There is no physical damage from the accident. However, I am worried about your psychological condition. Really? I know it's not easy, but you've got to start over, Ethan. You're not responsible for what happened. No fucking shit. It's my fault Jason is dead. No, it's not. He'd it's still dead. be alive if I'd been looking out for him. It was an accident. Accidents happen every day. You can't blame yourself forever for your son's death. How is Sean? He's a very solitary kid, you know, very focused within himself. He's really close to his mother. With me, he's more distant. And what about you, Ethan? What do you feel? Yeah, how do I feel? I no longer want to live. I have no reason to continue. What the fuck, dude? Not even for your son, Sean. I couldn't save Jason. Sean doesn't need a father like me. I just say you were depressed. Is there something else you, you want suicidal? to say, Ethan? Hmm. Yeah, that I sometimes have these blackouts. Times when I don't know what I'm doing. I recover consciousness sometime later, but I'm someplace else. And I have no idea how I got there. D do you think this could be related to the accident? You suffered a massive concussion and were in a coma for six months. We really don't know what effect a shock like that can have on the brain. That would be one of them, Doctor. I'm just saying. That's the end of this session. Uh, we'll continue this conversation next week. You were lucky, Ethan. It's very rare to survive such a traumatic accident. I don't exactly feel lucky, Doctor. Yeah, I just thought about killing myself earlier. It's just something about shrinks. They seem sneaky. I don't know why. Do you want to eat something? Uh, Is something the matter, Sean? No, I'm all right. Talk to me, you little shit. How did things go at school today? The teacher yelled at me for being late again. She's gonna send me home the next time it happens. I'm sorry about that, Sean. Next time, we'll really pull it together, okay? Well, we know that's even stuff on it. Aren't you gonna go play with the other kids? I don't feel like it. Oh my god, what's up with this kid? Yeah, I'll just get up. Fuck this. Why 
is a merry-go-round in a regular park? I'm just wondering. I'd like a packet of strawberry-flavored chewies, please. Thanks. <laughs> I guess there's nothing on Ethan's mind. What a fucking shock. Uh, let's go. Go back to Sean. Oh, damn. I'm about to say. Hey, I got you some chewies. I hate strawberry. Thanks. It was nice of you anyway. Yeah, he ain't saying nothing. I haven't been on a seesaw in a long time. What do you think? Yeah! Oh, really? He's getting on the seesaw. Okay. I'm getting somewhere with this kid. Nice play. Come on, Dad! Make me fly! <laughs> what is up with this kid? <laughs> Folks, y'all know I have a daughter. Even she doesn't act like this. I mean, when she happy, she genuinely happy. Not mopey the next thing you know. <laughs> no. Okay. At least she's having fun. There's nothing wrong with that. What about that merry-go-round? I bet I can push you so fast you won't be able to stay on it. Great! Uh, that face says different. Your body language is a lie. Well, knows more of the truth. The words that come out your mouth is a lie. You can! Faster! Faster! Come on! Faster! Faster! How about I just throw you off this damn merry-go-round? You Ugh! Hate this kid! Spinning. Good training for astronauts, though. <laughs> what about a swing? You want to go play on the swing? I'll push you. Okay. Aren't you too old to be pushed in a damn swing? I'm just saying. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Come on, Dad! Higher! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't give me a hard time. I'm being the best dance I can to you. I even found your damn teddy bear for you. Which you're too old to sleep with. <laughs> That was cool. 
Well, you open it up. Okay. You know what? You're not too bad. Now, let's see. What else is here? Wasn't there a slide somewhere? Looks like rain's coming. I think we better go. Okay. You know, sometimes I remember before, I mean when Jason was still here, sometimes I wish everything could just be the way it was before. Yeah, we know. Me too, Sean. Me too. Granted, I understand the kid's pain. He lost his brother. His older brother. I mean, he was young. I think if I lost my older sister like that, and I was his age, I probably would flip the fuck out too. No, wait a minute. That's just it. I would have flipped the fuck out. Hey, Dad, can I have a ride on the carousel? Can I? Sure. Go pick a horse and get on. I'll this get a ticket. This kid is acting way too normal for me. Way too calm. You know, I just wish everything back the way it was. One, please. But I'm gonna be dollar. happy and smiling. I've been depressed at least for maybe two years. Shit, I mean, just. No, Ethan. Oh, what the fuck, Ethan? Not good timing, dude. I'm never on time with that shit. Nighttime. That's impossible. I just shut my eyes a second ago. Um, ain't that how you lost your damn first son? I, I mean, just really can't remember do. a thing. I. How the hell did I get here? Oh boy. Sean, where's Sean? No, I don't believe it. I couldn't have. Ethan, you fucking idiots. Sean. Sean, I've got to find him. Sean. Where's Sean? Sean! Sean! 
that's how you shop for your kid, folks. If you if you're really worried about them, if you're trying to find an ass, Sean, if you're frantic. Sean! Sean! When are y'all for Jason? That just you know, sounded really fucking crazy. Okay, where's my kid? Where the hell's my kid? Sean! He's not here. You lost your youngest son. You fail as a parent! But you got the screaming right. That's the only thing you got right. <laughs> Next time we'll continue with Norman Jaden, which is how I pronounce his name for some odd reason. See you guys later.